everyone i've got a few makeovers to share with you today but before i do that i wanted to show you this lovely package i received from marna and Darren over at dolls rescued how nice of them to send me these they knew that i'd i won some in a giveaway um and was delighted with them and used them and so they sent me some more look at these these are shoe soles let's take some out and they're in sizes to fit the larger monster high dolls the 17 inch ones and they're also to fit like the smaller size monster highs and barbie type dolls that sort of size and all you need to do is add some fabric or wash oh, i used washi tape on mine and just put that over there to make it a slip on shoe and you can make it to match your dolls perfectly i used my last some of my last ones i used on um equestria girl dolls and they fitted perfectly and also they've sent me some stands i just need to add a piece of dowel in there and i'll have two stands i've got an orange one and a purple one for like the 18 inch dolls and i didn't have any stands for those so they'll be perfect thank you so much that's so nice of you it really is and they just sent me that just out of the kindness of their hearts sent me it as happy mail so i'm really pleased about that thank you so much i really do appreciate it and i will make good use of those so on to the makeovers first i've got this girl I've had these dolls a while. I've just been haven't been gotten around to doing um, showing the makeovers yet. So there's this beauty. She's a ballerina Barbie. You can see that she's got the on point toe. She doesn't have her shoes. I don't know whether she comes with shoes. Um, she's missing her earrings, but she really is a lovely doll. Look at that. Love the feathers on her outfit. She just is super. Really love her. Really pleased with her. Then I've got this girl, she's got the really fluffy hair. She's got that really fluffy hair, but she's got her earrings in. She's got the how big are your fish hands. She's missing her ring. I put her in that dress because I thought it suited her era more and she's got purple earrings. So I thought the purple purples in the dress would match those. I popped her in these little boots. She's actually lost one in the box, but it, it'll turn up, I'm sure. But I thought that would match the pink in her dress. So, yeah, like I say, I've lost one of them in the box, but it'll turn up. <laughs> so that's her. I'm not entirely sure who she is. So if anybody knows, I would appreciate you letting me know. She's got the dimple in her cheek. She's got the purple earrings. How big are your fish hands with a missing ring? and the fluffy Kineclon hair, which has actually come out lovely. Then I have this gorgeous splash and colour Barbie. I believe she's in her original outfit. She's lovely, she's come out nicely. Her hair's got a bit, <laughs> got a bit tappled in the box, but it's because it's got that glitter in it. You can see it's the glitter that's sticking up. But yeah, she's come out lovely other than that, you can see missing her earrings as well it's a shame when they're missing their earrings but you know it could be worse then we've got this stacy she's lovely i've popped her in this outfit she's got some little white shoes on that I found that fitted i'm sure i got those from aliexpress and i got quite a few in the pack so that's her i popped that little top on her it's like a it's odd shape the sleeves are but you can see she it does look quite cute on her doesn't it these look like monster high trousers to me, but they fit her really well, even lengthwise. So whether they just look the same, I don't know, but that's her. Then this little Stacy, she's got shorts and a crop top on. She's a similar doll to the last one and she has on the similar shoes. Not the same, but similar. Yep, she's another pretty little one. Gorgeous little face. Then I have this lovely uh, Sleeping Beauty zombie princess doll. She's come up lovely. She had her outfit on. I don't believe they come with shoes. I don't think any of mine have got shoes. Her hair's nice. It's uh, still sort of in its original style that I've just sort of redone there. So that's her. She's lovely. Then I have a ballerina Cindy who needs... <laughs> fringe sorting out 
but she's lovely. I've put, I don't think this is her original dress. It's one I've popped her in, but you can see she's got the, those sort of funny Cindy feet that they have. She's got the ballerina hands, so she can be posed like that. Yeah, she's a pretty doll, pleased with her. Then I've got this beautiful bead blast Teresa, really thrilled to have her. She's in her original dress, she's got her ring, she's got her earrings, her hair's come out lovely. It's quite thick that hair is, but it is the really soft Kaneklony hair. You can see she's even got her earrings in, yeah. She's lovely, so thrilled to have her. And then this little Chelsea doll with her orange hair, I popped her in that little dress and I found some little tiny Chelsea shoes on AliExpress so I bought those as well and they fit really well that's her then I've got another little Stacy I've got a few of these and I love them she's got on this is from one of the Snapstar dolls and I love it it's so soft I actually bought a second one of the dolls just so I had that jacket because I love it so much this dress came off a brat doll that I got in a bundle and it fits her really nicely and I love the colours on her as well. And she's got on some of those white boots because they're the only sort of ones I've found that'll fit these um, Stacey dolls. So that's her. Then I've got this girl. Um, I'm not sure who she is. She's not Barbie, she's not Mattel. Um, she's got no markings on her head or anything. So I'm, I don't know who she is, but she's a beautiful bride doll um, she's got this lovely dress on no shoes for her her hair is the soft Kaneklony or it could be nylon actually it feels doesn't feel quite as soft as the Kaneklon hair but she came out quite well her little headdress came out nicely her dress came up nice and clean she's a pretty little doll but I'm just not 100% sure which doll she is she has moon shaped crescent moon shaped earrings in and no ring because she's not actually married yet she's got she's in the process of getting married so that's her then this beautiful girl she's dressed in this outfit she is fashion activity gift set barbie and this i think is from a fashion activity gift set to the shoes and the clothing because i did already have one of these but not this particular one i don't think She's even got earrings in. She's lovely. She's really nice. Pleased with her. And she's even got a little bow in her hair. And you can put that and you can put that bow on her clothing as well. So yeah, it's just and this um skirt that she's got on can be turned into a cape. You can see it's got the little slits for her arms to go through. And you can turn her top around so that it turns into like a um strapless black top yeah it's all that sort of thing you can change all the clothing around to be different different things on her but that's how I've chosen to dress her then I've got this glitz and glam barbie she's dressed in one in this dress that was sent to me by my friend Ian love that dress absolutely love it so that's her you can see she's got nail varnish on her hands she's missing a ring but she's lovely she reminds me of the Stacey's with her hair with this um blue streak in her hair because you often get those with that in don't you but she's lovely doll look at that that's her yeah i think she's belle that's her her hair's nice she's even still got her little thing in her hair she's got her dress on no shoes because i don't believe they come with shoes but that's her she came out nicely she's pretty isn't she for a zombie at least <laughs> then we've got the zombie Ariel, she's still got her thing in her hair. She did come out nicely. Her hair is that like, it feels like cheapy nylon hair. That's what it feels like. She's got her little shell bra on. She's got her mermaid type skirt on. So that's her. Then I have this gorgeous jewel hair mermaid Barbie. She's beautiful. Look at her hair. She's come out lovely. She's got the the little um, tiara crown still in her hair she's got her earrings in she's got a ring on she's got her tail and her little bralette she's complete I believe I'm so pleased to get her and I got her for such a good price really pleased with her she came up beautiful next I've got my lovely Mary Poppins Barbie love her so much I just love her look at that 
that she came up lovely her little dress and coat dress came up lovely she's got her big carpet bag there she's got her ring on she's no earrings for her she doesn't have them she's got her little hat she came up beautiful i'm really pleased with her and she's got these red boots on so yeah really chuffed with her really really pleased with her i'm pleased with them all you know what i'm like i love them all then we've got this girl. I'm not sure who she is because she's got articulated arms. I would have said she was a fashionista, but I'm not sure because she's got articulated arms. She's got this side ponytail. I've popped her in this dress and these orange shoes because they match the orange on the dress. But she's a pretty doll. She came up nicely. That's her. Then this gorgeous happening hair, Barbie. Look at her hair. It's come out so nicely. She's got her earrings in, she's got her nails painted, look at those nails. And I've dressed her in this outfit, I don't think, that might be her original top, I don't think so. But, And I think I've added the shoes and the jeans, I don't think they were her original ones. So that's her, she's lovely, really chuffed with her. Look at that hair, it really is lovely. And I've got this little girl, she's lovely, I really like her. She's a little bath time fun Chelsea, something like that. She's got this little squirter in her hand and she's got this little duck swim ring on. So cute. You can't take that duck off. I think it is fixed. Well, I think it's just so tight that it won't come off. I don't know whether it's fixed to her or not. I think it is, yeah. It looks like it's fixed at the back here. Look, you can see fixed onto her body. But she's cute, she's lovely. She came up nice and clean anyway, because when kids have had them in the bath, they tend to get black mould on them if they're not dried out properly. I managed to get all that off her. Then we've got the little Princess Sophia. She's a cute little doll. She's a tiny little doll. I've, I've quite gotten into these little tiny dolls at the minute. And she's got some little blue shoes on. I think they're moulded on, which is good, because I won't lose them then, will I? <laughs> Yeah, she's a pretty little doll. I liked her. And then these three Chelsea's, I found them some clothes and the little shoes from the pack I got from AliExpress they've got on. So that one's got a purple pair on with a little denim dress. This one's got a pink pair of boots on with that little colourful dress with an ice cream on the front. And then this one's got a little denim skirt and top on with little blue shoes. Oh, very cute. So that's them. They came in a, I'm sure I got them in a lot. Then I've got this girl. She's a Steffi Love Simba doll. She's pretty, isn't she? This is actually a Steffi Love dress as well. No shoes for her. Then I have this girl in the Discover the World with Barbie California outfit. She's come up lovely. Look at that lovely outfit on her. She's got a hat there. It's come up nicely. It really is lovely. I love it. She's got a little necklace, little blue beaded necklace on there. And she's even got her little <laughs> parasol. Can't keep a parasol in her hand, but she has got a little parasol there. She's lovely, so she'll go with the rest of my discover the world with Barbie dolls. She's gorgeous. Then I dressed this girl in the discover the world with Barbie Sri Lanka outfit. I think she looks really good in it. I love it. I love those colours on her and it's a lovely, it's one of my favourite of the discover the world with Barbie outfits. I love the colours of it and the detail on the dress there. Really lovely. So that's her. Beautiful. Then I've got this really pretty uh, she's an unusual one to me. I'm not sure who she's made by. It just says Disney on her, on the back of her head. Uh, yeah, it just says Disney China. So I'm not sure who she's made by, but she's an aerial doll and she's in her pink dress. I believe that is her original dress. And her hair is so soft. Look how nice it is. It's come out really shiny and silky. And it's beautiful. I love the colour of Ariel's hair. That's her, so she'll go into my Disney collection. Love these dolls, she is just gorgeous. Look at her, she, I've put that bow in her hair. This is a dress that she came with and also these socks and shoes. Look how pretty she is. Yeah, I think that sort of, those bows, yeah. 
she's got those little bows on her shoes which you can slip on and off they're like on a little a little thing look you can put them on and off her shoes so i like that and they match her dress perfectly which has come out gorgeous can't remember what makes she she's not on our generation oh i think she's a toys r us doll because it says jeffrey llc on the back of her head so she might be a journey girl because journey girls have that don't, oh yeah it says journey girls on a lot and i do like the journey girls but she's come out lovely she's such a gorgeous doll look at her face love her and i keep saying i'm not getting any more 18 inch dolls and if you saw what i'd ordered from ebay this week you'd faint you would honestly i'll have to try and hide it, hide them from my husband <laughs> you'll have a fit if we see them oh dear and then the final girl I have is this one. Look at her. She's an Our Generation doll. I do love the Our Generation dolls. They're like a cheaper version of American girls. But honestly, their quality is lovely. Their hair is always lovely. And I do love a redhead. And she's got lovely blue eyes. Absolutely love her. And I love this lip colour as well. She's in this outfit. She's got a tights on. She's got some little shoes on. She's come out lovely. I'm not sure what her name is. Um, yeah, but she's gorgeous. Really pleased with her. So that was my lovely happy mail and my makeovers. I hope you enjoyed that. Thank you for watching. Bye for now.